This is your Catholic Daily Journal for Sunday, January the 6th, 2019. Today is the Epiphany of the Lord, the first moment in which the Gentiles, the non-Jews, were shown to be a part of God's plan, when three astronomers, probably from Babylon in modern-day Iraq, observed the bizarre movement of Jupiter, and Polaris, Mercury, Venus, and Mars, and surprised the Holy Family with gifts symbolizing the three missions of Christ, gold for a king, incense for a priest, and myrrh, prophetic of his passion and death. Today in 1929, Mother Teresa arrived for the first time in Calcutta on the Huli River in India and began caring for the poor and the sick. She would go on to establish the Missionaries of Charity. Mother Teresa's sisters have a peculiar requirement for a religious order. Applicants are expected to be visibly joyful. Mother Teresa turned away many young women who wanted to join her sisters by telling them they didn't smile enough and that the poor needed to see joy. We know from her personal writings that she suffered great inner turmoil through much of her life, and yet everyone who met her commented on the depth of her joy. Mother worked with the poor for 68 years in Calcutta, starting at Epiphany in 1929. Today is the birthday of another influential woman, the French martyr Saint Jean d'Arc or if you prefer, Joan of Arc. Born of a peasant family in northeastern France, Joan claimed to have received visions from the archangel Michael, from St. Margaret, and from St. Catherine of Alexandria, instructing her to support Charles VII and recover France from English domination late in the Hundred Years' War. Despite being dismissed as a lunatic and the fact that women weren't soldiers at the time, the Maid of Orléans led soldiers to victory time and time again. She was burned at the stake in May of her 19th year as a rebel and a heretic and possibly a witch. But 25 years later, a real inquisitorial trial was held and she was exonerated on all charges by Pope Calixtus III. She was declared a saint and later a national symbol and patroness of France. Today is a busy day in the church calendar. In addition to Epiphany and St. Joan, today is the birthday of St. John of the Cross, the great Spanish mystic and Carmelite. It's the birthday of St. Gertrude the Great, the German mystic who had such devotion to the holy souls in purgatory. On this day, the French bishop, St. Honoratus, the Catalan bishop, St. Raymond of Penafort, the Dutch mystic, Gertrude van der Oosten, and the Canadian monk, André Basset, were all born. It's a good day to ask for some extra prayers from the saints. The Catholic Daily Journal is supported by listeners like you. For more information, visit catholicunderground.com. Until next time, be on the lookout for the Lord at work in your life.